everyone, welcome back to an episode of Create with Linda. So I'm coming on, guys, because I'm doing a collab with Ian Good for game day appetizers and foods and stuff. Game day foods. So um, what I'm making today, guys, is I'm going to make um, pigs in a blanket, and I'm going to make um, the, the little hot dogs in a little, like, seasoning in a frying pan. So I have this big thing of, of um, little smokers. They're not the hot dogs. They're, they're the little smokers. So I'm going to um, put these in a frying pan with a little bit of butter, some garlic, and I'm um, not sure what exactly seasoning I'm going to put in. I'm going to see maybe soy sauce or maybe a little Worcestershire. They're really, really good just to snack on. My husband's going to eat these for lunch. So I'm going to make these right now for the appetizer. Okay, these are really good for game day or for whatever. So guys, um, just really a really good idea. All right, so let's, so let's get started. All right, guys, so here are the ones that are in the frying pan. I'm going to let them get brown, and then I'm going to start seasoning them. All right, guys, so they're in the pan. They're cooking. I'm going to put a little bit of salt and pepper, a little bit of pepper, a little bit of salt. I'm going to put a little bit of onion powder. little bit of garlic. Mm. Guys, you could put anything on these things. You could put barbecue sauce. You could put, um, like I said, soy sauce or Worcestershire sauce, um, just to give it a little flavor. They have, I put, there's butter in here already, so they're cooking in butter. All right, I'm going to go to the refrigerator and pick us and pick something to put in here. Like just a little bit of something, nothing really too flavorful because I don't want to make it too strong, but I'm going to definitely put, add something into this other than what I have in here. All right, guys, so what I decided to put in was steak sauce. I'm going to put just a little bit. I'm not going to put a lot because like I said, I don't want it to be strong, but I just wanted to give it a little bit of flavor. So I would say it's probably about a tablespoon. Just to give it a little bit of flavor. You see this great value? It's really good. Okay, so a couple of flips. And these are done. These just are, you know, they're cooked already, so they just have to heat through. So I'm going to take them off of this flame, put them on this very low flame, just let them sit for a couple of minutes, and those are done. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, do the other little wieners, little smokers. I'm going to do them um, pigs in a blanket. But I only have one thing of croissants, so whatever, how many it makes, is I'll, I'll use these. If I don't use these for something else, I can freeze them or, you know, save them for tomorrow or the next day or whatever. So that's what I'm going to do. All right, guys. So here I am. I'm putting, rolling the, let me get you guys down more, the hot dogs in the croissant. These croissant things, I'm telling you, they don't come out great out of the thing. Even the, even the Pillsbury a little difficult, too. I don't know why, but that's the way it is. So I'm wrapping these up. I'm going to do some like this. And then I'm going to put, I might put some cheese in some of them. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. Get these moving and in the oven. Like I said, I'm going to make as many as 
I have the um, the bis, you know, the croissants for. And they didn't come out for. They didn't come out like. I have a package perfectly, so I'm kind of making the, the makeshift. Some of them are really big and then some of them are really small. I don't get that. Like, no. Probably only gonna get like two or three more out of this, guys. I don't even think that two, maybe. Just uh, kind of stretching it out. But regardless of how many I'm making, you make as many as you want or as you need for your party, after, you know, your football, your game day, baseball, whatever. Whatever it is, guys, game day. You make enough for what you need. Just roll them up. Like I said, these are pretty, This this these croissants are pretty forgiving. Even if they come out like, you know, they don't come out into croissants, which they don't. You just makeshift them into a into a wrap, you know, wrapping them up. It's not a big tragedy. So don't panic if you open up a can and it doesn't come out perfectly. You could still work it out. See, look, this is not perfect, and it just roll it up, and that's it. So it's very simple. Wrap this around a little bit, make it fit. Okay, so what I got out of these was 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I got 10. Okay, but like I said, you make as many as you want for your um, for the party that you're having and enough for your, your whatever, you know. So I'm going to keep these aside, put them in a Ziploc bag, and probably put them in the fridge for a day. And if we don't eat them, I'll put them in the freezer and we'll use them during um, Thanksgiving or whatever. Or, you know, whatever for, um, for uh, you know, appetizers and snacks. So I'm going to put these in the oven, and then I'll show them to you when they come out. They're going to be delicious. All right, guys. So here it is. I'm so excited. These are the um, the ones with this little steak sauce in them. I have a little blue cheese dressing to dip them in. These are the I made sweet and sour honey ones with some duck sauce to dip in. Guys, I sauteed it, sauteed them in honey and some sort and some uh, duck sauce and a little bit of a little butter and then you dip them in there and then those over there are the pigs in the blanket with a little mustard to dip it in now i'm going to taste all of them and let you see how they taste let me turn this around and i'll show you all right let's taste these first put these here so you guys can see what i'm doing And blue cheese. So good. So good, guys. That big package of little smokers that I bought is so good. Mm. Five eighty something, I think, in, in in Walmart they were. You get a lot, a lot of them, a lot of them. So good for a party. Throw them in quick. You do them so many ways, guys. Delicious. Okay? That was the ones in a little bit of steak sauce. These are the honey with um, duck sauce. So I, it's there. I call them sweet and sour. Mmm. Oh, 
my guys are so good. Okay, delicious. The only thing that would make this a little better is a little bit of spiciness in the duck sauce. A little bit of hot, I think. So good. Who wouldn't want to eat those when you put those out for some people, friends, a couple of friends over or whatever? Now the pigs in the blanket. Here you go, guys. A little spicy mustard. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Some little spread out here. This right here with the amount of little smokers that are in this in the, in that thing for five eighty something. So you figure six dollars. This is like eighty five cents. These these, these croissants at all you can get the store brand. Like I said, where am I here? Um this is oops. Um, this is under ten dollars right here. And this will feed three or four people. Maybe more. Delicious. Delicious guys for football. For friends coming over. Anything. Check them out, guys. Game day appetizers. Three ways. So yummy. So listen. Guys, it's so simple. You don't need to do it, put a big, a big spread out. You having a few people over for a game, or whatever. You could do it cheaply. Don't think, think outside the box. I mean, think outside the box. Just little things like this that are, that are that are cheap and good. You can make with no, with really no effort. So, guys, I hope you liked this video. It was so much fun doing the game day appetizers with Ian. Good. Thank you, Ian, for doing this collab. It's really fun, and I love to watch all the other videos. It's a lot of fun. Um, so if you guys like this video, hit the thumbs up button on the bottom. Don't forget to hit that notification button with the bell and um, with the bell so you guys can be notified every time I, I upload a video. All right, guys, share and, and like it, and um, thanks for watching. So I'll see you on the next video. I'm going to eat my appetizers now. Game day, guys. Have fun. Bye.